What's going on everyone and welcome back to WellTube. And in today's lesson, I'm gonna be showing y'all MIG root in the 6G position using a six cent Schedule 80 pipe. I know I'm ready to burn, are you? Let's get to it. All right, for the MIG root, we're running with 035 hardwire, 7525 gas, and um, we're running at a 532 gap, 330 second landing. And you wanna stay on the leading edge of the portal when you run down on the 6G. Okay, you're fighting gravity a lot here. Uh, the reason why we go downhill, it's mostly faster production. So um, when you go test out on, this, on the MIG route, you're gonna do a downhill route. I'm running at 17.5 on the volts and 185 on the wire speed. I stop right here on the bridge tag. So when you have a penetrated tack, you wanna make sure to feather down real good so you can get a good tie-in on the top side, okay? Make sure the angle of your, your MIG gun is out about a 10 degree down, okay? On that landing, it's very important to put that landing, okay? Uh, 330 second landing on there, because if you put a little landing, it's gonna get real heavy on the inside of that root. You don't want that. You want everything to look the same, penetrated wise. About a 16 to an eight. Always stay in the leading edge of the puddle. And stop at the bridge tag. All right, now we're starting the left side. Broke off that bridge tag, feathered down my stop, and I kept going. You kind of want to have a drag angle, okay? But also going side to side at the same time a little bit. Keeping a good pace. Like I said, staying in the leading edge of your, of your puddle. It's rare that you're going to get an uphill uh, MIG root test. That's very rare. Everything is mostly downhill when it comes to taking a 6G MIG root test. Okay. And always make sure to clean your nozzle after every time you stop. Very important. Okay. You're also using an 035 tip as well. All right, now we're finishing the right side. That's our last side, okay. I turned up uh, my voltages up to 18 volts and 195 on the wire speed just because you can see the gap size, okay. It kind of shrinked a little bit on me, so right now it's about an eighth inch of a gap. Um, so the hotter you put it, the more it's gonna penetrate with a smaller gap like that. Staying at the leading edge, always. And go all the way down. Always find your comfortable spot, okay? Do some dry runs before you run these, these MIG roots. All right, everyone, well, there you have it. That was a MIG root, short and sweet. And as always, if you have any suggestions for upcoming welding videos that I should do, please comment down below, or you can follow us on Instagram, at WeldTube, so make sure to follow us. And if you don't want to miss out on any of our welding tutorials that we publish every Monday at 7 p.m., please turn on your notification bell right next to the subscribe button. And remember, burn, learn, and eventually, y'all gonna earn. Y'all have a good one.